saying things people already know out loud is tight. Avada Kedavra. You park in front of your house, I park in front of my house. We're here to learn, so we'll move on. What's up, everyone? It's Adam from FWCI, and we're gonna check out Hunger Games. This is my first time seeing this. I honestly couldn't tell you the first thing about this. Uh, it's like a, I know there's a chick with like a bow and arrow. Um, I can't even remember which actress it is. Uh, is it like set on like another planet or something like that? I think it's like a like a tournament of fighters in some I, I don't I don't know I don't know <laughs> I have no idea but I thought now that the Harry Potter series is finished and I had so much fun doing that there were discussions of the Hunger Games in the uh, comments so I thought I'd finally check this one out because yeah again never seen it before but I have been reacting to a lot of uh, animated Disney movies lately this is another genre that I've never explored and I've been enjoying that so if you are new to the channel go check those out my Harry Potter reactions were a hell of a lot of fun if you really like Harry Potter and you haven't seen my Harry Potter series, do yourself a favor. Uh, it, it may trigger you to no end or you might laugh with me the entire time, except for the last movie. I'm also reacting to Brooklyn Nine-Nine, The Last of Us, Mandalorian, heaps of other stuff. Go have a look at it all. But you're here for the Hunger Games. So am I. I've got some snacks in case I do get a little bit hungry halfway through. But when I hear the word Hunger Games, all I think is there's a Eminem line that's... Uh, these rappers are like Hunger Games. One minute they're Mock and Jay, next minute they get their stuff from Migos, then they can't be Drake. That line's one of those ones that just stuck in my head. Anyway, Hunger Games, let's do it. From the Treaty of the Treason, in penance for their uprising, each district shall offer up a male and female between the ages of 12 and 18 at a public reaping. The hell is this? These tributes shall be delivered to the custody of the capital and then transferred to a public arena where they will fight to the death until a lone victor remains. What the f freaking... Henceforth forever be known, pensions be known as the Hunger Games. <sighs> but it's been the way we've been able to heal. What? We've been able to heal? What, by making teenagers kill each other? So I'm still confused of when and where this is actually taking place. Is this like a futuristic, this is where we're headed kind of, uh, situation? Oh, there's the bow. As advertised. Whoa. Hello, darling. Um, that's quite a head of hair you got on you there. <laughs> She puts Luna Vachon to shame. I go that way. <laughs> I have Prim and you have your brothers. They can come too. Prim in the woods. <laughs> or maybe not. What was wrong with Prim? Leave her alone. This is a child. Scared out of her mind. <laughs> Man, they're really excited for that bread. Things are rough in this world. That's a mocking Jay. How much? You keep it. It's yours. Thank you. Very nice of you, old lady. Oh, look at you. You look beautiful. But you better tuck in that tail, little duck. Oh my god, is she gonna get summoned to the friggin' Hunger Games? You wanna see what I got you today? Yeah, I don't know if you need to be like... Protecting this young girl so much, you might wanna just start getting her prepared, I think. <laughs> this is fucking weird and intense and just uncomfortable man welcome 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 happy hunger games and may the really? odds be ever in your favor that is a rough way to start this speech whoever you are when the traitors were defeated we swore as a nation we would never know this treason again and so it was decreed how, how do you get to that? The lone victor, bathed in riches, would serve as a reminder of our generosity and our forgiveness. This is how we really <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about this one, guys. The time has come for us to select one... This is like, um, just bloodlust, I think. <laughs> 
I'm pretty sure they used to draft people into the military. Might have been in America or England. Uh, they had like a lottery thing on TV. It was like, next up we're going to do the month of June. And then they like spin this wheel. A date comes up. They're like, anyone who's born on that date, Primrose you have to enlist. Everdeen. Oh man, that would be horrifying. Whoa. Prim! Why don't you send people between the age of like... How old am I? Uh, people between the age of 40 and 60. There we go. That'll give me a few more years. We have a volunteer. Uh, Mr. Mayor. I need to get out of here. You need to get out of here. No! Oh, he's going in as well, is he? No! No! No, he's just going to take it. District 12's very first volunteer. Bring her up. <laughs> yeah, I guess that shouldn't surprise me. What does this mean? 3D? Devon, get the tables? Peter Malark. Oh yeah, he doesn't want to go. <laughs> he's not, he's not prepared. And may the odds be ever in your favor. Happy Hunger Games is a terrible terrible thing to for her to say <laughs> it's so unbelievably tone deaf and shitty hmm <laughs> he comes back around huh thank you and yes she can hunt but this means she's gonna have to murder a bunch of teenagers no matter what you feel you have to be there for her do you understand wow i promise you on the upside, she can return with, you know, a, a huge bounty of riches, apparently. 200 miles per hour, you can barely feel a thing. I think it's one of the wonderful things about this opportunity, that even though you're here, and even though it's just for a little while... What is this lady's angle on all this? She seems to be really enjoying this, and not understanding these people are traumatized, or she's really enjoying it, and she can fully tell that they're trauma traumatized, which is way worse. <laughs> Woody, what are you doing in this? Embrace the probability of your imminent death. <laughs> Thanks, Woody. <laughs> the moment when a tribute becomes a victor. Oh, man, that's uh, friggin' barbaric, man. <laughs> Just bludgeoning him with a brick. Give me a chance to wake up, sweetheart. This mentoring is very taxing. Come on, man. Get your shit together. A knife or even some matches can mean the difference between life and death. And to get sponsors, you have to make people like you. Mm, what? Sponsors? What is he talking about? You get people that can give you like tips on where you can find stuff? This is absolutely insane. Saying we might need to hose you down again before we take you to Sinna. What? <laughs> Why you gotta hose her down twice? Now, usually they dress people in the clothes from their district. Yeah, we're always coal miners. Yeah, but I don't want to do that. Did they explain about trying to get sponsors? Mm, really? That's how. That's what this is all about. It's not real fire. These suits are built so you won't feel a thing. That's pretty real to me. What? Real fire? What are you talking about? <laughs> Donald Sutherland is in this? <laughs> oh god. Power plant workers. <laughs> right? So that's what the districts are? Just like different, like, um, industries? <laughs> yeah, boy! <laughs> Sponsors, open up your wallets. Give me some matches. Uh, I want some, uh, what else can we get? A bow? And your sacrifice. Yeah, I, you're welcome, I guess. Happy Hunger Games! And may the odds be ever in your favor. <laughs> Evil old bastard. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is, of course, this is going to rub all of those other people the wrong way. You get sponsors, but you put a target on your back as well if you do anything too eye-catching. Most of you will die from natural causes. 
10% from infection. How long does this thing go for? <laughs> the fact that they have to train with the people that they're also then going to try and kill is... An, <laughs> is absolute madness. <laughs> the punk! You took my knife! Then take his door off me! Just sit here! I'll finish you right now, kid, huh? Who's this? With his knife? <laughs> Did you see the Patrick Beverly of this of this show? And in Special Academy till they're 18, then they volunteer. By that point, they're pretty lethal. What? That would be a smart thing to do, to be honest. They win it every year. That means they've got somebody bringing all this money back to their their district every year as well. Peter's strong. What? He can throw a hundred pound sack of flour right over his head. I've seen it. Okay, well, I'm not gonna kill anybody with a sack of flour. <laughs> You know what my mother said? She said District 12 might finally have a winner. But she wasn't talking about me. <laughs> wow. Thanks, Mom. Those guys are looking at you like you're a meal. Draw it. All right. What do you got? Oh my god, it's Huey! <laughs> what is Huey doing in it? What are you doing? What are you doing, Peter? Holy shit! All right, okay, let's, uh, <laughs> let's leave this man alone before he throws a car at us. My God, really? Oh, betting odds on this? Why is there such a, a blatant like gap between rich and poor in this? And clearly Woody used to be poor and now he's got money because he won the thing, but whew, it's so, like, egregious. Katniss Everdeen? District 12. So they'd be a bit lickered up and, like, a bit restless at this point. Probably want to get this done with. What are you going to do, Katniss? <laughs> <laughs> These rude pricks. Nobody saw it. No. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Right in the eye. Let's do it. <laughs> that will do. Pig, Thank that'll you. do. Thank you. Fair consideration. <laughs> Yeah, here's your bow. <laughs> Good on you. I hope you noticed we have a serious situation. <laughs> nice shooting, sweetheart. <laughs> well, they looked pretty startled. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> now, what did you say that thanks for you considering? <laughs> it was a boss line. From District 1, Marvel. Marvel. Peter Malone. What's your score, Peter? Eight. That's not bad. That's higher than he probably expected. Lucky he can throw a building if he needs to. From District 12. Is she gonna get a 12? Katniss Everdeen. 11. <gasps> yeah! That'll do. <laughs> oh. To Katniss Everdeen, the girl on Fire. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she is on fire in more ways than one. I mean, if we just wanted to intimidate the districts, why not round up 24 of them at random and execute them all at once? Whoa. So it's your, your doing, is it, Don? All right. Hope. Hope. It is the only thing stronger than fear. Oh, this sounds like evil as hell, man. Contain it. Right. Oh, is he trying to corrupt his game and doesn't want District 12 to win for some reason? No, he says he wants to be trained on his own from now on. No, oh, no. What's happening with Peter? They've just written Peter off. They're like, well, he's definitely gonna die. 
Caesar Flickerman. Caesar Flickerman. Good lord, look at that hair. And that suit. And this building. And those chairs. Christ, this is... <laughs> This is absolute madness! This is insane! Are you excited? Let me hear it! <laughs> this many people this excited about that much death is just hard to comprehend. Let's have a warm round of applause for Glimmer! <laughs> wow, these people are really relying hard on these sponsors. Marvel! <laughs> <laughs> well, I was just hoping that I wouldn't burn to death. <laughs> I, I, I find her charming. <laughs> oh! Uh, she's putting on a hell of a show. As she stares down the barrel of a massacre. Ketna 17, the girl on fire! <laughs> I'd say that creeped me out, but this whole thing has been creepy right from the start. Starting with you. Um, uh, alright. <laughs> do, yeah, do I smell like. <laughs> the women in the crowd reacting to that. You definitely smell better than I do. Well, I've lived here longer. That makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> wow. And the, the audience laughs at applause. <laughs> Jesus. You go out there and you win this thing. And when you get home, she'll have to go out with you. <laughs> I don't know if that's quite how this is going to work. Because I suspect he's talking about Katniss. <laughs> He did you a favor. He made me look weak. He made you look desirable, which in your case can't hurt, sweetheart. He's right, Katniss. Of course I'm right. Oh, that's gross. That sucks, man. This, this world is just disgusting. <laughs> I say this world is not that far off of what things are like in 2023 as well. Oh, what was that dude saying? Hope is stronger than fear. Is she going to, like, hook up with him so he's got, like, I don't know, I don't know how, how that would exchange to hope, but something, <laughs> something to live for. Yeah, I just keep wishing that I could think of a way to show them that they don't own me. Okay, Peter, that's an interesting goal to have. So there's 24 people in this, two from each district. Mm, don't go for the bow. Wait. 28. 27, 26. Broadcast everywhere, even into these like slums. So it's not even just a case of, oh, does she come home or not? We'll never know. It's, we're going to watch her slaughter. Don't do it, Katniss. Don't run for that bow. Man, we're going to be down to like 15 pretty quick. Jesus, man. She should have just waited for him to slaughter her and then knife him. That would have been the smart thing to do. Your tactics need work, lady. Sorry, child. 15 year old. Get people to like you. Good work. I thought they said most of you will die of natural causes. We just lost like half of the the people just with that. <laughs> that, that little bloodbath there. Damn, alright, this is interesting. You just pick up a and of course, backpack and boom got a bunch of random stuff in there? That's it, that's really So we lost twelve. Christ, that's 50%. By the way, my missus really loves the TV show Alone. Um, she's picked out an episode. I asked her to pick out like a crazy one. Would you guys be interested in a reaction to an episode of Alone on this channel? I've never watched it. I have like a very vague idea of how it works. Wow, this is some high-tech business going on right here. 
Alright, Peter's still kicking. That's good. Oh. So that's what, District 1 and 2 teaming up? Please don't kill me! Oh no! Damn, man. These are some cold hearted fucking people. Yeah, I'm sure. You better be. Yeah, that was your snare found back there. What? Really, Peter? Go to hell, you bastard. Two kilometers away from the nearest tribune. Let's turn her around. What? How much control do these guys have? Oh! I mean, I guess she's the girl on fire, but is this how it's... Whoa! What the hell? That was a fireball, man! Fuck, man. So what are these guys gonna do when it gets down to the last four? Just what, a big honorable... It's a pretty sound strategy, actually. Do it myself. How badly did he hurt himself? Maybe you should throw the sword. Okay. Somebody make a fire. Well, you could like circle around the tree and keep using your bow and arrow, man. <laughs> it's, I feel like she's pretty vulnerable right now. Of course, everybody's watching this. I keep forgetting that fact. So, what do these sponsors mean? Why generously stay alive? H. Oh, that's uh, Woody, isn't it? She's still in a... <gasps> Claudius, I think those are tracker jackers. Am I wrong? Oh. Those things are very lethal. <gasps> oh, okay, okay. I get it, I get it. She's gonna cut it down and fuck them up. This can't be good. Is she getting stung by him or what? Yo. <laughs> yeah, I thought, um, I thought Katniss had it bad getting like a few stings, but yeah, f oh, was it the eyes? Hey, that's all right. She was the chick that got the bow and arrow. What are you doing? Go! All right, I'm glad that he's a double agent. But yeah, she's in rough shape, man. She's still reeling from that burn on her leg. The venom of a tracker jacker sting. The tracker jacker sting, of course. The good news is everybody else got it way worse than you did. That little girl's trying to win just from survival. War of attrition. How long was I asleep? A couple of days. I changed your leaves twice. A couple of days? Oh my god. Is all of that true? What? You and him. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is inside like a giant artificial everything? Like all the weather and like Truman Show styles? Like everything's controlled? That's great. Back home we use them to signal all the time. Okay, that's a handy little trick to have. One of you is still gonna have to die, though. Get back. <laughs> An amazing plan. I want to see if she's gonna figure out this booby trap. Yes, it's of course. <laughs> We're all watching this. <laughs> so why does this whole thing have to be like medieval type weapons? Like, there's no like guns or anything like that, grenades or explosives, it's just straight up like blades and spears and stuff. Jesus. Oh, that's a hell of a booby trap, guys. 
they were sitting real close to that as well. He's gonna die. Bro. <laughs> Rue, that's the girl's name. Katniss! Help! Katniss! Whoa, how the hell did you get into this mess? Oh, really? Uh, she was doing good too. She lasted a long time. Huey, <laughs> you evil, evil man. Boy, <laughs> a teenager. Did you blow up the food? Every bit of it. Good. It is good. <laughs> Man, no, no, it's kind of a scarily, kind of graphic, accurate, lifelike way of what it would look like to die. <laughs> That's dark, man. Katniss is gonna burn this establishment to the ground, man. We've got three more movies after this. There is no way she's not coming after the people responsible for all this happening. And even though, yeah, she's an absolute ruthless killer. Well, can be. Um, she's very, very sweet-hearted. And, yeah, really just wants the world to love each other. And that's just met with an infinite amount of force. Far out, man. Again, this is eerily accurate to real life. I guess the more things change, the more they stay the same. There are lots of underdogs. And I think if you could see them, you would not root for them either. <laughs> you prick. Everything he says is just repulsive. From now on, two victors may be crowned oh. if both originate from the same district. This will be the only announcement. Oh, yeah, that's going to throw a spanner in the works of um, the uh, the other two teams, because it's a little bit more complicated now. Peter. Oh my god, Peter! Peter! <laughs> what? Hey. Dude. <laughs> Lucky somebody doesn't come up and like take a piss on you or something. <laughs> district 12, also known as the leg wound no. district. <laughs> we'll just get you some medicine. Can't, I don't get many parachutes. Mmm, young love. But what about your other mate back in District 12? Yeah, this guy. <laughs> yeah, the harsh reminder that everybody in the friggin' galaxy, I don't know where this is even happening, is, is paying attention to this. You fed me once. Oh my god, wait, him throwing that loaf of bread into the ground was him feeding her? These war is strange times, my friend. You should be trusting yourself that he needs medicine, man. He's gonna die of a friggin' infection by morning. Should have grabbed one of the other ones too. Leverage. Yo, whoa. Did you kill her? No. I heard you. Oh, her name. Get out! her name. Oh shit, that's he's with Rue. So what are we down to now? It's like less than ten. Okay, now you. I'm okay. No, come on, you need it too. Peter, relax, man. <laughs> These weirdos watching this, like, it's some kind of, like, source of entertainment. 
I'm allowed to watch it like it's a source of entertainment because it's a work of fiction. But in this world, this is the real deal. <gasps> oh, who's that? Night lost, Peter! You'll be dead in a minute! I didn't know. What? I never even knew she was following me. She's clever. Oh, it was that girl. That's it. Wait. This thing will exist in this world now? Okay, I thought it was going to be like 20 meters tall. <laughs> I was like, how are we going to beat this gigantic dog? But this one seems more manageable, more manageable. Okay, game maker. What are you playing at? They get him, they get him! Oh, what? He's already up there. Come on, you got this. Dead anyway. He's asking for it, like... I didn't know that till now. Oh, that is rough, man. He is having a big moment. Not that it matters. That'll do. Good work. <laughs> Was that really necessary? Oh, now the dog's like, eh, I'm bored of him now. So we got our winners? District 12 with the sweep? There has been a slight rule change. What is this? Is Dumbledore running this? Two victors from the same district has been revoked. <laughs> ah, come. No, 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 no. Oh, piss off. Is that what we find out in the fourth movie that Dumbledore is pulling the strings here? You got the family, Katniss. One of us has to die. They have to have their victor. <gasps> no. They don't own you, man. Three. Stop! <laughs> May I present the winners of the 74th Annual Hunger Games? They're not happy with you. <laughs> Why? Because I didn't die? Because you showed them up. Oh, yeah, good point. That's probably not a great idea. Is this guy about to get offed? Oh, wow. They're upset that he um, didn't let them eat the, the death berries. And what about you, Peter? I mean, she saved my life. We saved each other. Just the big show, a big load of bullshit. Thank you, it's from my district. They must be very proud of you. Yeah, I don't know what that exchange is all about. But I don't like it. I guess we try to forget. I don't want to forget. Yeah, what do you mean forget? That's a little bit of a misleading thing, but I guess he was pushing the whole, look, they'll love it, it's good for our image or whatever. Donald Sutherland, man. He's no, he's no joke. That was not at all what I thought it was going to be like. I didn't know there was any of the, like, outside world watching in. I, I assumed it was like a, some sort of, like, elite group, you know, making people fight each other. That was kind of all I really knew about it. But I didn't realize how commercialized it was and how broadcast it was and everything like that. So, very interesting movie. I will be watching the next one as well because I know this is a very successful um, franchise. So, I'll definitely be watching more of these. Katniss was a very interesting character. Character, and that weird wrinkle that they've got now where the this you know guy and girl have to be in this weird pseudo public relationship and they don't really but they kind of do like ah oh, there's just so many layers to that they really left this in a uh, a fun cliff hanging kind of spot because there's a lot happening with the main characters now that i'm curious to see where it goes but the hunger games themselves were absolutely brutal 
Um, the game maker, he's gone. We're not going to see him or his curly beard ever again in this series. Well, maybe, I don't know, maybe he comes back. Donald Sutherland is in his finest form. He's just a real, he seems like such a scumbag in this, like a real piece of shit. Woody Harrelson is great as well. I enjoyed his character quite a lot from his alcoholic, you know, start until, you know, how he went at the end. And now I'm going to guess that this is a book series as well. Was this book before movie? Is that how it worked? Because I feel like Woody Allen's character, Woody Allen, Woody Harrelson's character um, would have a lot more of a uh, progression from being not really giving a shit to like being on board because he kind of flipped on a dime, but it was okay. The action scenes were very hard to watch in some cases not because there was anything bad but like the whole shaky cam thing I've, I've never really been too bothered about shaky cam and action sequences but it was really noticeable in this with that being said there was also a lot of other um you know directorial choices made during this that i really liked a lot of interesting camera shots and angles and you know ways of uh, communicating certain things with the audience so overall i think it was a great movie and uh, yeah like i say i'm very keen to see what's next for katniss everdeen and uh, peter whatever his name was and donald sutherland and uh, pretty much everybody else we know is dead, except for her other boyfriend and her mum and her sister. That's like the only other characters that continued on. But let me know in the comments what you thought about this movie. Let me know what you thought when it came out. If, did you read the books first? If it's a book series? Curious to hear from you guys down in the comments. And as always, everyone, be well, stay safe, look after your friends. See you in the next video. Peace.